Hello, welcome back to Brand Sushi Live Noting. In this episode, I'm going to show you how to create this kind of artwork uh, using just geometry nodes and a simple plane. Alright, so this was actually um, inspired by works, works by Benny Govert. Um, he showed me the blend and then I thought, okay, this is, a, this is going to make a good tutorial. So let's start with a plane. And with this plane, uh, we know we can subdivide it and it's become like a circle. Right. Um, before we do that, however, what if we just apply geometry nodes? And there's this little cool trick you can do: subdivision surface inside the geometry nodes, and also split. So these two nodes is very cool because it's like operating. Um, it's like 3D modeling, but operating as nodes. So you can plug this in, plug that in in so you can subdivide this guy at the same time you can also split by edge angle okay let me show you if I simply apply smoothing you can see it's splitting the face based on whatever you plug here it depends on this arrangement and also the subdivision so you can turn off sub boundary smooth so it remains uh, just plain like that and now you can subdivide and actually the trick here is also to pipe this out so we can control the level of subdivisions from here while for to make this into a circle we can subdivide it outside. Okay, so we have control over this. So that's cool. All right. So what what can we do next? Let me save this very quickly. Geo circle. Um, we can put this into a collections. I just gonna I just tap M, create a new collections call it circles I'm gonna make a couple of duplicates so the first one subdivision level 0 second one 1 2 3 okay so we have four different objects I'm gonna options G so they're gonna be in the same spot now with different subdivisions um, I could create another plane so this is gonna be the, the master plane and with this guy you can create an array this array can go up in the y-axis so you hit control you can merge it and now we can simply use another geometry nodes this time we want to do instancing based on collections but turn off all collection get the collection circles now suddenly we have this artwork So with the collection, um, okay, we have also control for the random seed. So the random seed can go out. So this is, um, yeah, another interesting usage of geometry nodes. And suddenly you have a way to do this. Okay, so there you go. Um, you can actually replace. So instead of using this, since we already have this geometry nodes dot zero zero one, I believe you can. So we don't have polygon adaptive yet, but maybe in the future. So 
clearly it, this this works only on the flat plane. However, if you use uh, something like sphere chalk, you can use polygon adaptive and replace every polygon face with all these dots. Um, yeah, I'll just gonna let let you to try to do this yourself. Um, so hopefully you find this interesting and useful. So with this collection, you can just hide it. With this artwork, actually, oops, with this guy, I believe you can file export alembic, turn off instancing, so it's going to be a real object, selected object only, visible, okay, just save it out, file import alembic. So we have the new object with this guy. You can see we can we have a lot of windows pattern. They are all real object. We can join them. Control J. Actually, Command J, and then you can solidify. And then you can perhaps randomize the thickness. So yeah, I thought you might like this as well. All right, so that's pretty much it. Hopefully you find this interesting. Let me know what you think, and I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.